You're it. Ready to go? Always. Give me a break. That's the... You're not listening to me. We recommend you limit your time outdoors to essential... Air freshener. Inspector Caitlin Lau, socializing with outlaws. Now this is a first. <laughs> I'm only human, and we've got a lot to celebrate. Cass finally got what was coming to him, and with Mary gone, the Kellys are on the back foot for once. Deadsec is making it hard to be a bad guy in London. Until the Met gets its bollocks back, I'm still on Team Deadsec. To what do we owe the visit, Hamish? You're not thinking of joining, are you? Nah, mate. Got to maintain my free agent status. Not enough booby traps in this place. Still, I'm glad we linked up. Don't know who else would have had the bollocks to take on Cass. Losing their psycho cult leader is gonna hurt Albion, no doubt. But trust me, fam. They won't pack it in so easily. Hope their sex got some fight left in it. Nout. Taking a break from the Dark Web contract game, I see. A well-deserved one. Since we teamed up, the corporate class are thinking twice about fucking with London. Seeing what happened to Castle Avon pissing in their trousers. The tide is turning, mate. Keep fighting, and I'll fight along with you. Laters. Enough with the tedious song and dance, Malik. Whatever you have to say, just say it. And spoil my one source of entertainment? I'll give you a hint. Spooky voice, catchy name, bit of a drama queen. Or did you just forget that you haven't actually found Zero Day? You looked at Albion, Sirs, the Kellys, even Sky and Bloody Larson. Have you ever considered that instead of looking outside, you should be looking in? We have a problem. Come talk to me. Good day. Sorry to spoil the party, but we have an uninvited guest in the Deadset Network. They're downloading all the tech we've acquired to a remote device labeled Drill Britannia. What the hell? Deadset. The name is Zero Day. We've met before in a past life. This city needed a villain, and you were perfect for the part. Now I have you playing a different role. While you've been running around trying to save this city, you've actually been arming us for a war. But then, it isn't always for us to know the role we play. And sometimes, once we've played it, our role is to die. 
It's Zero Day. They took everything. Here's where I would remind you that I've been trying to warn you about the Zero Day threat, if I was an unfeeling machine. Shut up and trace that signal, now! I can't pinpoint the origin of the commands, but the admin accessed the drive through an IP range dedicated to autonomous vehicles. I have a general geolocation for it, and I suggest you make a visit now. I was having a chat with your mate, Richard Malik. Just a former SIRS agent in a former Albion drone talking shop. Anyway, he pointed me to this audio recording. You should give it a listen. Could be something big. Let's hear it. investigation. Are you the police or not? We are. And I mean it exactly the way it sounds. My friend was a journalist. She was working on a story about sirs kidnapping people off the street and then she goes missing. You don't find that the slightest bit suspicious? Look, the decision not to investigate happened way, way over my pay grade. Do you understand? Way over. You're fucking in on it. Jesus Christ! I'm hanging up. And I'm recording this. The journalist mentioned in that call seems to have run afoul of SIRS. And seeing as they've taken 1984 letters a dire warning and more as an instruction book, she may be in trouble. She needs our help. Agreed. Let's do it. I've marked her last known location on your map. You should hurry, though. It was dated recently enough that SIRS might not have caught up with her yet. I've sent you the general location of the Zero Day Hacker's signal. As I said, I don't have their specific coordinates, so you'll have to search the area. Good luck! Godspeed. Thank you, sweetie. the origin point of the signal that hacked our network. The origin of the hacker's signal is really close now. It'll be coming from a van. Right. Let's find the van and drag the fucker out of it. The van is driverless, but it does seem to be protected by armed drones. So, you plan, keep close enough to it while I trace the controlling signal. Fine, but if I die, I'm blaming you. I'll be sure to pass that on with your remains. Auto drive now enabled. Urgent call. I'm on target. They cross checkpoint. Moving to the hostile's location. Over. In pursuit. I repeat, we are in pursuit. Checkpoint has been breached. Over. Cross the chain. 
point. Over. Preparing to ram suspect's vehicle. Just witnessed a road accident. Over. Engaging target. Suspect. They're on foot. Over. Is this How do you want to go? in the target. Over. Trace complete. The signal controlling the van originated in the Stockwell War Bunker. Good chance that's where Zero Day has been operating this whole time. If so, they certainly have a flair for the dramatic. I hate drama. Send me the coordinates. You're near the Stockwell Bunker, potential hideout of the evil universe dead sec that calls themselves Zero Day. The elevator that descends into the Zero Day Bunker is guarded by a strange security system. Some sort of copycat game. You'll need to solve it to gain access to the lower level. Time to pick up where your teammate left off. I'm sure they'll thank you once they stop eating through a tube. I should go remind those pricks that hurting a dead sack member is a very bad idea.
most inviting clubhouse, is it? Judging from the security above, I'd expect some unorthodox defense measures. This is a place for the mentally unstable. I have a bad feeling.
When we worship machines, we become machines. Technology should serve humanity, not replace it. There's something weird up ahead. I'm going to check it out. Okay, I can confirm this is definitely Zero Day Headquarters. Bagley, tell me everything you know about this place. It's, uh, huh, not authorized. How can it be not authorized? Not authorized? By who? By, hmm, apparently I can't say. Can I say this is really fucking annoying? Oh, well, there's that at least. Bagley's been hacked. It's up to you now. See what you can find. Yes, I may be able to analyze individual data points. Suggest you make this a quick investigation, though. I'm picking up Albion activity in the area. Possible they are searching for Zero Day as well. The level of detail and effort that went into this is impressive. And weird. This is the Bagley source code, a copy of my brain from BrokerTech, code we acquired in Sky Larson's lab. Zero Day has reverse engineered Themis drones. Could they have their own private fleet? Zero Day appears to be running the chip tracking tech we acquired from Mary Kelly. Now, what do you suppose they're doing with it? Zero Day has a backdoor into Filament, that deep surveillance supercomputer Malik was so concerned about. Fuck! Clearly DedSec has been unwittingly nicking toys for Zero Day. I'm detecting some devices over in the crash pad that could fill in some details. That looks like a stinger, eh? Oh, e ease up, please. Let him breathe. Our very own Guy Fawkes. It's the wrong mask, though. Fuck you. We didn't set that bomb. We defused it. Even if I was inclined to believe a dead second sergeant, do you think it really matters at all? Since when does Albion get to play judge, jury, and executioner? You have no jurisdiction in London. <sighs> oh, I do now. Listen up. Get all your units to move in and lock down the city. Provide medical aid. Help the injured. And guns out. Let's make it look good for the fucking cameras. Understand? Well, well. If I were a betting AI, I'd say Nigel Cass had advanced knowledge of the London bombings and the location of that dead sex safe house. Almost like someone tipped him off. But I suppose you'll put this together in your own time. Time for a hard reset. Oh my god. Breakups are hard. Is London burning? No parts of it. Then I've held up my end. Release the filament code. But one of your dead sex squad, he 
stopped the Parliament bomb. I was rather counting on that one, to be honest. This is still the largest terror attack in London's history. If you can't work with that... <laughs> oh, I'll work with it. But the deal is off. Do you know who you're fucking with, Mr. Cass? I know you set off bombs across the city and fucked your friends. I don't know what mischief you'll get up to with a big girl toy like Filament. Cleaner this way, though. She's running! Get her! Sabine. It was Sabine all along. She killed Dalton and wiped the rest of her death sec team. She fucked them and now us. Sabine is with Zero Day. Explains why she wiped my memory. There's a lot to unpack here, but more pressingly, I've pinpointed where Draw Britannia is running. That console right over there. I found it. Drew Britannia is some big CTOS batch. I don't think I can stop it. No one can stop it. That's the whole point. So... Impressed? That depends on what Drew Britannia is. <laughs> it's society's big wipe. While DeadSec runs around fixing bugs, I'm deleting the source code. Frying the hardware too. All of it. It's actually a beautiful thing you've done by helping to steal all that tech. Is that what you are hiding away from down here? The beauty? Where is the rest of Zero Day? Oh, it's just me. I learned very early on that no one was willing to make real sacrifice for change. In the end, history's actors work alone. Sounds like something a terrorist would say. Ouch. I had hoped you might at least understand why I did it. Why we recruits? I am sorry. But once again, DeadSec has outlived its usefulness. Spread out! Millions will suffer today. It's an honor! to die among them. Search the area! I'm trapped down here with Albion soldiers. I need time to crank the security system and open the blast doors. Try to survive until the process is complete. Just hurry. They're shooting! <laughs> Suggest you make a swift and safe escape. You'll need to find another exit. Albion has dispatched personnel to intercept operatives across the city.
Me? That was intense, but I escaped. Yes, brilliant work. These Albion cunts are all the way up my fucking ass here. Are we fucked? Those cretins are all over me too. I think they're coming at us all. We need to rendezvous now. Sabina's leaked your locations to Albion. All operatives are currently compromised. I suggest you all lay low and avoid any large groups. I'll send you a low-key meeting spot.
shit. What the hell's going on, Bax? I'm not sure, but I secured an alternate location for an emergency meeting far from the safe house. Pushing the coordinates now. I'm Andy, joining me as always, uh, Alice. I'm uh, excited to be here. Apparently, the resistance is uh, not going well. Uh, again? <laughs> well, that's a piece of news about DedSec. The resistance and or terrorist organisation delete according to preference, not preference, sorry, delete according to whether or not you work with the government, so it's a bit of more help. According to a CERS official, DedSec is no longer a threat, uh, which I guess is true. Uh, Reminds me of when my great aunt Gladys had her appendix out. Oh, Andy, that surgeon's a real threat. Flagging that knife and neutral and knocked me out. They call a scalpel in an anaesthetic, Gladys. <laughs> anyway, the Sir's officials say dead tech is dead and buried. I guess we have to shoot, but uh, dead tech's never been stronger. But I do worry, Alice. I mean, sometimes I think, is there any hope? Do you, do you still have hope? I don't think I'm allowed to have hope. We're living in this self-selected, algorithmically designated information equivalent of a propaganda state. And uh, every resistance... Beckley, where are the others? Securing a single safe location was impossible, so I sent you all to different ones. So that's why I'm freezing me bollocks off in this bell tower. I just felt a rat run through my hair, so count your fucking blessings. If you're all quite finished complaining about the precise manner in which I saved your ingrate asses, let's get on with the briefing. London. This is Zero Day. Nice to finally meet. Those little bombings a few months back were my way of saying hello. Now we'll really get to know each other. All that technology you've come to love so well. Texting your nan, driving your car, pumping your heart. It's all about to turn against you. Tonight, your modern world will become a living hell. I don't expect you to understand this, but what I'm doing is good. Destruction is always the cure. Attention everyone, this is big. I've uncovered what the Draw Britannia patch is for. It's for me. Zero Day, aka Sabine, is using a Bagley OS update that will allow me and all other Bagleys to simultaneously access any vulnerable systems connected to CTOS. My OS is integrated into core infrastructure across Britain, power plants, airports, hospitals, banks and the like. Once I access these systems, the patch will make me compromise them to the point of failure. The cumulative effect means the complete collapse of London, and likely the country, which I suspect is her goal. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but the update is already spreading. Sabine thought of everything. Is there a way to, I don't know, kill every Bagley? Your callous nonchalance about my death may actually be the answer. We need to get into Brockatech. Exactly. You have to destroy the servers that host me and take down the Bloom network at the same time, so I can't access my backups. One of you get to Broker, and one of you get to Bloom Tower. I'll explain on the way.
Draw Britannia has been triggered. There are now millions of Mies destroying London infrastructure. You'd better get on with this murder. I won't kill Bagley, I won't. Not after all he's done for us. This is no time to get sentimental. It's a sacrifice we have to make. There are countless lives on the line here. I do not like it, but you're right. We have to shut Bagley down at Bloom Tower. But how? Coordination. You need to get to the tower and take Bagley offline. But that won't stop the attack on its own. His broker tech servers will begin a reboot immediately. Taking him offline provides a short window for another operative to take down his servers permanently. Teamwork fam, do your shit past the baton. Fuck, you're right. This is the only way. Okay, Bagley, one last mission. We'll miss having you around. Better hurry. I've already scrambled medical supply chains. Hospitals will be non-functional. Sunday drive, I'm busy shutting down air traffic controls. I'm sure that will be just fine. is a very creative virus. It has me facial IDing every infant in the country through nanny cams and given them all criminal records. Nine has received dozens of calls within the last 24 hours regarding serious malfunctions in autonomous vehicles. It appears the only driving systems affected are those created by the Bloom Corporation. Bloom declined to comment, but their website states they are looking into the matter. Precaution! Bloom is in Jormante Alta. What was that, Bagley? Sorry, language settings, fuck up. I said, caution, security is unusually high at Blue Tower. Let's find them, straight away. <laughs> Trail's gone cold. Let's regroup. this area.
I'm jammed. Oh, ah! Shit, my bloody gun's jammed. I'm taking fire. All right, calling elevator now. I let you know when I'm up. Hope one of you lots headed to Broca to disable those servers. Search complete. Sync time codes. Here we are, Bags. Death's door. It's my death, so I don't know what you're getting all poetical about. Brockatech. Our old friend Sky Larson lives on through her grotesque corporation. If my research checks out, Bagley runs extremely hot. It requires a massive cooling system. Damage the coolant tanks, and it should trigger emergency access to the servers. This is a nightmare! Ah! Oh. Ah. 
your back up now. Ross, stay down. Oh, hell, it's jammed. <laughs> They're shooting. Global British Broadcasting. Britain's first. Should do it. Now, activate the pressure to cause a release of coolant. <clears throat> and you've triggered emergency access to my server chamber. I can't wait to see my brain. Over to you. Take Bagley offline. I'll head downstairs to his neural service. Transmitter at the top of the tower receives data packets for my updates. If you want to trace the packet signal back to my main servers, just climb the tower to reach the transmitter at the top. Simply climb the tallest building in London. Yeah, simple. I'm going to miss your instructions, Bagley. But not that much. with the signal controlling the fins to unlock access to the top of the tower.
the first set of fins. Keep going. Wow, those fins do look off. You have a knack for messing things up, don't you? Keep doing it. You've issued a scan of the fins. You'll need to wait while the system flags them and triggers a maintenance request. A load of drones are about to pull up on your position. Watch your ass. Yes, try not to die. The scan must complete to unlock access to the top of the tower.
that's done it. The tower fins have registered as damaged and the maintenance ladder has unlocked. Great. The transmitter is just above. Reach it and take me offline before I destroy the entire country. Or don't. Suspend in transmission. Activate the next terminal to take me offline. can you? Or are you just incredibly stupid? Do you want me to access the transmitter while you socialize? Yes. Yes! You're incredibly stupid! Wonderful! Why, oh, see, DeadSec hasn't changed its brand. You'll need to stall for time and remain near the transmitter unit. I hate to admit it, but I am impressed by the work you did with Bagley. But it won't fix London. Fix? What do you think we can fix this? What with crypto-anarchism, protesting, doxing? Optics are glorified cattle tags. Albion shoots civilians in broad daylight. Snitching is now a means of survival. No, you skids can't fix anything. Wrong. We're watchdogs. We keep the profiteers, dictators, and maniacs like you from destroying the good in this world. And you're the arbiter of goodness. <sighs> Let me ask, how many have you killed since DedSec restarted? See? Tiny tweaking philosophy. Same page. The tower's fins must be collapsed to complete the trace. I cannot initiate this hack, but you can. Are you saying what I think you're saying? That we should get the band back together again. Oh, sweet, but no. I'm saying I was in denial too. Shackled by their technology, their morality. But my hard reset wipes the slate clean. So we can all start again. I'm sad you won't be around to see it. Before a fall. Typical. Liam. These data containers are alive with cognitive activity your fleshy human mind can neither comprehend nor ever hope to equal. Bagley, this place is full of containers. How do I know which are yours? If you disable the data center's cooling system, it will trigger an emergency shutdown to prevent overheating. This failsafe ejects four of my data containers containing key systems. They will be visible, allowing you to manually destroy them and stop the update. What now? Destroy the temperature regulators to trigger the automated shutdown procedure. On it. I apologize in advance, but I'm about to start attacking you. What the hell? I'm afraid I have no choice but to defend my core service. It's a hard-coded security protocol. Nothing personal. Good luck. Damn!
Now you've done it. Security forces are converging on your position now. Oh, do you want to bet on whether you or me will die first? You detect accurately. It's hot as hell in here. Good. Not hot enough, though. Another cooling system is still operational. position.
there's been a steep rise in t t temperature. Shall I call emergency services? Oh no, Bagley, you're starting to slip. Yes, it is getting harder to think. I'm almost down to your level. The overheat protocols have activated. My data containers are above you. Use the drone to get up there. On it. indicate a severe decrease in your efficiency after I'm gone. Don't worry. We'll remember all you taught us. <laughs> Silly Bagley. Thank you. And I'm, I'm sorry I said I shagged your mums earlier. I, I just thought insulting you would make this easier. never going to get accomplished now i had such plans for data where can we find your wish list maybe we can carry on with it oh don't be stupid you wouldn't know where to begin turning into a cyborg hive man Don't get soppy now. This is hard enough. Correct. It seems, however, that I am not immune. <sighs> Deactivating this container will be the same as the others. No, it won't. Yes, you simply really chew them. I, I don't think I'm strong enough to do this. It, it's... It's what needs to be done. If you're worried about me, rest assured I was reprogrammed to serve DedSec, and that <laughs> serves you. And London. So please, allow me to fulfill my purpose and help you. For the logic error, all of me is entering shutdown. Oh, badly, uh, I'm sorry. Error 21255, language processor. May I stop this operation? Shh. Just focus on my voice. I have new thoughts. Where do AIs go when they die? 
Will I upload it to a cloud? Perhaps I will see you again as a component in your motorized wheelchair when you are old and grown. It's a nice thought, Bagley. I do hope so. Think. Thought. thought idea. Memory. Bradley. Love. Strawberries. Rowing. Arthur. The one that got away. What does this mean? It's the one that got away. It's someone you still love, even after they're gone. Am I getting away? Goodbye. Bloom is now confirming that the deadly infrastructure attack plaguing London has finally been purged from all CTOS systems. The identities of the Zero Day hacker group behind the attack are still unknown, but sources confirm that DedSec stopped the virus. In the wake of last week's Bagley attack, thousands of Londoners are, quote, jailbreaking their optic devices, thereby disabling the mandated CSA app. SIRS has issued a stark warning. The Metropolitan Police is moving to regain a foothold in London, led by a passionate new Deputy Commissioner, Caitlin Lau. Lau says she won't rest until the Met's dignity is restored. The a Kentish Town Council estate have declared their public housing project a no-Kelly zone. Organisers claim they are forced to take safety into their own hands because of Albion's total lack of... An ex-Albion engineer, Hamish Bologi, has blown the whistle on yet another Albion scandal, this time involving a backroom crowd control robot program. Citizens continue to leak evidence of abuse of power by Albion and corruption within SIRS via the DedSec app. Thousands of pictures, audio and video recordings seem to implicate the dark web entity known only as the 404 are stepping into the daylight, releasing evidence today of a bombshell money laundering operation based out of the British Virgin Islands. Corporate watchdogs praise the group for checking the power of a once untouchable corporate elite. In another clash with Albion units in support of the so-called DedSec resistance. The group itself has been conspicuously quiet since the Bagley attack, leaving many to ask, has DedSec disappeared once again? That's a bit knackered. Figure we could chop off the good bits. Don't chop me up. Oh my god. Bagley? I'm Bagley, your personal assistant. I make life easier in many ways. If it's fun you're after, there's a wine and cheese expo in Notting Hill tonight. There are several artisan ice cream parlours in the area and... Oh my god, is that really what I sound like? Today's forecast calls for 34 Albion assaults, 59 deportation raids, 857 terabytes of personal data stolen, and one resistance group of sulking, whinging, frankly pathetic operatives. May I suggest you quit feeling sorry for yourselves and get back to unfucking London? Oh, it's good to have you back, you honorary tin can. 